It's showtime! What did you think when Roly Romero came here on the last day and said he is coming for Errol Spence at 147? And he's gonna take you out. He's a nut. He almost lost it to that old man, so. <laughs> Need a rematch. You need a rematch, you know, man. <laughs> hey, man, it looked too good, man. The ref really helped them out, man. They needed to the say, hey, man. And that ref used it. He's good. He's a yeah. good ref. But that old man was on his ass. He was. <laughs> he was on his ass. I was like, man, he's going to lose some. It's about a grandpa, man. God damn. Oh I was like, he's going to lose grandpa. Oh, my God. Oh. He drives him and everything. I said, I, I watched him. I was like, he in trouble. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm always ready for that. Earl Spence clowns Roly Romero. <laughs> I think low-key, Earl Spence is a comedian. Hey, yo, what up, you guys? It's your boy, Boxing Fanatic. Back with some more boxing. Make sure you smash that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. For the latest and greatest content. So, Earl Spence sat down with Brian Custer. And, boy, Earl Spence, I said it. I think he's a low-key comedian. Boy, he too funny. Clown and roly. Saying that he about to get beat by somebody granddaddy. <laughs> he said, oh, that boy in trouble. <laughs> yeah, he talking about Tony Weeks helped him out. Yeah, Tony Weeks did help him out because, yeah. Now, that's the second time Roly done, he done won the fight. And the referee helped him out. And Roly talking about he want to fight Earl Spence. Yeah, Roly, he's a good guy. He's a good character. I like Roly, though. I mean, he ain't shy of too many words. Yeah. You know, Roly, Ro I guess Roly do not like Earl Spence. But I can understand. Roly can sell a fight, and that he can do. If it was up to him, Roly would be his own promoter because I think he promoted himself way better than Mayweather Promotions did. Leonard Ellaby when he fought Javante Tank Davis. And he sold that fight, in my honest opinion. He sold that fight. But talking about going up to 147 to fight Earl Spence, and he struggled. He struggled with Barbosa. So, man, I, I don't think Roley should do that. He need to stay away from 147, stay away from Earl Spence. I mean, it's cool to, you know, the clown, crack jokes, because everybody, you know, joke. Everybody know uh, Roley is a, is a jokester, and they don't really take that guy too serious because they already think, you know, he three french fries short of a Happy Meal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so <laughs> three french fries short of a happy meal. <laughs> yeah, I'm talking about the one that come in the kids' meal. <laughs> but uh, yeah, Roly, um, he a clown, man. Y'all, y'all really can't, you know, take Roly too serious. Um, Earl Spence, he was just basically saying that, you know. He not even really worried about Roly because Roly not even on his mind. He got a crawfish boil today. He trying to boil coming up July 29th. And that's against Terrence Crawford. And he been waiting for this showdown for, uh, for a long time now, for about three or four years now. But the time is finally here. And, you know, having Roly in the way of what he got going on, he don't need that kind of distraction. He just got to stay focused on the main task at hand, and that's against Terrence Crawford, which, you know, that fight is already uh, signed, sealed, and delivered on Showtime pay-per-view July uh, 29th in Las Vegas at the MGM Grand. Man, it's, it's going to be fireworks. Fireworks. Uh, Earl Spence said it's scrap season. It's man down. Going to have a crawfish boil. Moby Dick. And Terrence Crawford say he going to fry some fish up. Earl Spence say he going to roll him up and smoke him. So, 
man, I wish both of these fighters can back all of that up. And hopefully they do back it up. Come July 29th, they got a chance to put hands on each other and get paid for it. And they can settle it all in the ring. Roley against Terrence Crawford or Roley against Earl Spence? Nah, man. Because uh, if Tank did him the way he did, that won't look too good for uh, Roley, man. Roley a good guy. But I would like to see Roley versus uh, uh, Ryan Garcia or uh, Regis Progre or Adrian Broner or Gary Antoine Russell Jr. Either one of those guys will put hands on Roley and smoke Roley up out the water. Guaranteed. For sure. I mean, he, he, he can crack now. They can't underestimate his awkwardness, but he can crack. But other than that, nah, he need to leave Earl Spence alone, man. And that's just my thought on it. Um, Y'all let me know what y'all think, all right? Make sure y'all comment and like and subscribe. One love, one life. I'm out. Peace. If you enjoy content like this and you want to see more, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe.